as a front-end application developer, one really need to have a good sense of user experience design because all of the time we are dealing with either mobile application or a web application and basically what we are designing is a user experience, right? How user is going to click, how user is going to see your data. And the reason why I'm telling you this because today we are going to talk about one of the design tool which is very friendly and which I have used in past to create my application and I'm talking about Wondershare Market. So here I am on a market website. If you haven't signed up already, you can do it over here. But I already have account. So I'm just going to skip this part and I will do the sign in. And once you log in, you're going to see this interface where you have all of your previous projects. And if you want to create new, you can do it from here. And one of the things which I like most in Wondershare Market that it is a handoff tool. Like you can start on your browser, you can continue on your desktop, on Mac, iPad, wherever you are. So that gives you the flexibility to work from anywhere. You don't really have to have uh, the application installed on your system. All right, so let's go ahead and create a new template. So here you can create a prototype which is like a mobile or a web prototype then you can create a flowchart and maybe we will see in the future videos dedicated video for flowchart how you're going to work with that how you're going to make a decision input output and all those things and not only that you can also create a mind map which is like a artboard you can put your designs you can put flowchart you can put decisions stickers and you know it's just like a, a blank canvas where you can design whatever you want so for today's video let's quickly design a prototype where i'll be creating a simple website and you have all this template to choose from so i'm going to choose the web page click create so here we have our brand new web project now let me just guide you with all the tools and functionality they have on the top what you see here is like your toolbox so if you want to design something if you want to write a text or box or shape whatever you want you can pick it from here and then again you have a list of inbuilt components now this is the exciting thing which i really love about wondershare market that they have pre-built components so every time you want to create a button or input field you don't really have to draw a rectangle or circle they have all those component inbuilt and of course you can customize it as per your theme and they have ton of it like they have the form they have the navigation components charts drop downs media image slideshow everything you ask they have all inbuilt so you can prototype your application in no time right and then next you have a set of icons so obviously in all the application we need icon for uh, every page right uh, we need to have user icon we need to have send button icon download button icon so they have a pre-built library of icons which you can use and it's included in the same license so you don't have to pay for it and then they have a built-in stock images so for any purpose if you want to demonstrate some of the features some of the user uh, thumbnail image you don't have to go to internet and search for it it's all built in the same system and finally you have a list of pages you created so let's go ahead without wasting any time create a simple dashboard page so I'm going to pick text component and drag it over here it's that easy and then say hello wonder share right now on the right hand side you will see the properties panel so let's customize the font as well i'm going to make it black 900 oh that doesn't look good so let's make it bold 700 yeah this is fine we have the title now next i want to add a slideshow for that we have a carousel component let me just see over here perfect this i will place in the center or you can just as, as per your liking, as per your design, you can modify the sizes. Everything is flexible. Now let's go ahead and provide all the images. I'm going to use this beautiful car. For the second one, let's say I want something horizontal like this. And for the third one, maybe I will use this landmark. Cool. Now when I'm going to play this page you're gonna see an actual working prototype of this application whatever we have developed in just a minute or two and it's not just like a image or something it actually works it has a timer it has the dots and you will see you will feel like you're actually uh, being the final product right and you can share this to your clients you can share as a prototype to your developer and as you like and you can customize this up to any level you want so instead of having hard edges i will just say that i want a rounded corner just like this one 
and it looks awesome amazing isn't it and you can also define how much time it takes to move to the next slide so everything is built in right over there so let's go ahead and quickly create a simple website i'm just going to demonstrate you some component like here i'm using image with a rounded corner radius then a text and of course you can modify all the properties like font font weight and you can do that on an individual part as well it's quite easy right now next i'm going to showcase an icon as i said earlier it has inbuilt set of icons so you can use that and here i have just used a logout option in the form of power button perfect now let's spice up our page with some dynamic content so for that i'm going to use a slideshow and it's also called as carousel so if you want to search for carousel, you will find it easily. And then just I'm going to provide all the images. You can add more images if you want. And with some rounded radius, it looks perfect, isn't it? Now, let me just uh, fill up the remaining space on the right hand side. So for that, uh, I will just write some uh, subtitle or slogan or whatever. So here, Codex, we always say like design, develop and deploy all the three phases. And now I can see that our website has started taking a shape. I know that it's not perfect. Uh, we are just demonstrating it, right? So there's a lot of things which can be aligned perfectly and which can be corrected. But I just want to showcase you some of the component and how to use them, right? So here I'm creating list of items on my website. So say for example, I have online course. I have training materials. So for that, I will create a list item. Now I've just use a simple rectangle removed its border and then provided some shadow now again using the same tools like image text for title text for a uh, description now one more thing you can do instead of having a fixed uh, text you can have a rectangle and your content will flow along with the text now you can use inbuilt components like star if you want to show a star rating or something like that and they have a tons of inbuilt component you can see on the left hand side so I will highly recommend that you go ahead and check those component first because it will save a lot of time and it will give you professional design within no time. Perfect. Now I think our item looks pretty fine. You can provide image either by browsing for your computer or from the stock image they have and you can choose it from the different categories they have, right? So this one for online course looks good. I will just group them everything together and I'm going to duplicate it a couple of times. Finally, let's have a look what we have created so far and this prototype it's going to play and you can interact with it so it looks actual final product. That's it for this video. We have learned about the prototyping tool, different tools we have, all the inbuilt components and you can also do flowchart and mind map inside Wondershare Market. And if you haven't tried so far, I will put link in the description and in the first comment as well. So you can try for yourself. You can experience how Market helps to design prototype really fast, how you can draw flowchart, how you can work on a mind map, how you can collaborate with different teams. And if you are someone who wants to learn designing who wants to start with mobile application development web designing web development you can surely go ahead and give it a try for wondershare market thank you so much and if you haven't subscribed the channel yet go ahead and subscribe it for more such updates in future i will see you guys in the next one